Okay, we'll talk about it. Good, good. good day, hello, and welcome here in the Token Venture Capital. My name is Javier. And as every session here, we bring with innovation, technology, and solutions you want to hear about. During all our sessions, you hear it from the project owners or the CEOs of the of the projects. Here we have a very interesting project. We're going to meet LimoCoin, Tim LimoCoin, represented by Emil Perfect, founder and CEO, and Jeff Combo, head of innovation and development in LimoCoin. Gentlemen, welcome. Good day. How are you? Oh, I'm very fine. Thank you very much. Perfect. Thank you. Welcome. And uh, before we move on to the interview, just as a reminder to our viewers, you can always see our previous shows and content by visiting latoken.com slash vctv slash shows. And as an important reminder, anything mentioned here is not any type of financial advice. Do your research before making any decision. Is your choices and your responsibility. With that said, gentlemen, I think we can start this interview with a set of questions that we have. Can you tell us where are you from and a little bit about your team? Okay, thank you very much. My name is Emil Pafesim, like you see. Uh, here is my collaborator, Jeff Kombu, head of uh, innovation department but i will speak in french and he will translate in english because my english is not very good for traders uh, you know so uh, uh, i'm coming from cameroon je viens du cameroon je suis mis par pessim je suis uh, camerounais de nationalité uh, ça fait uh, six ans cinq ans déjà que je suis dans l'industrie de la crypto monnaie depuis 2006 2005 2000 I think we might be experiencing some connection issues. Yeah, connection issues. Okay, I please go ahead. Quite... No. Yeah, okay. Yes, okay. So, uh, je disais tantôt que je viens du Cameroun. Je suis Camerounais d'origine, je suis Africain. Et depuis cinq ans déjà, euh, mon équipe et moi avons pu bâtir une équipe solide, une communauté solide autour de l'industrie de la crypto-monnaie. Ça fait que... Euh, Vu le succès que nous avons eu au passé dans ce secteur, parce que euh, je crée Global Investment Trading en 2017, en 2017, après un success story dans la crypto-monnaie en 2016, j'ai commencé à investir dans la crypto-monnaie en 2016, en août 2016, et euh, en 2017, j'ai créé Global Investment Trading, ayant donc amagasiné un nombre d'expériences et de succès dans cette industrie, euh, j'ai décidé de tokeniser notre plateforme que j'appelle Lié Plus Mal depuis juillet 2021. Et aujourd'hui, nous avons le Limo Coin, qui était d'abord un moyen de paiement, mais aujourd'hui, nous l'avons tokenisé, nous l'avons mis sur les plateformes. Et euh, derrière, qui est soutenu par une communauté de plus de 300 000 personnes, et qui se projette d'être utilisé dans tous les ménages, parce que le Limo Coin aujourd'hui est la monnaie de l'Afrique est euh, la monnaie qu'on va utiliser en Afrique. C'est pour cette raison que nous sommes là aujourd'hui pour vous présenter ce projet, pour vous expliquer les tenants et les aboutissants de ce projet et pour vous démontrer comment est-ce que vous allez pouvoir euh, tirer profit de cette crypto-monnaie qui commence en Afrique. Jeff, you can translate. Yes, of course. Thank you, CEO. Thank you, CEO. Um, Mr. Mipafasim is our CEO. He's uh, involved in the uh, cryptocurrency industry since around uh, six years from now. And uh, he had a really good success in the cryptocurrency industry. He uh, built Global Investment Trading, our model company, in uh, 2017, May 2017. And uh, he made uh, the product Lia Plimal. Um, According to the success of this product and this project, he decided to tokenize the product, the project, to tokenize the platform. And uh, now we have the Limo coin. The Limo coin 
were a private token which was, which was used as a payment way uh, for community and for investments. And uh, now we have tokenized the project and now we have it as Limo coin as public token. And that's why we are here today to present you the project, the token and how it can be useful for you as trader, as investor. Okay, very interesting. Now, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, can you, let's go to the beginning. Uh, when you were trying to develop the project, the token, what is the problem that you foresaw and motivated you and your co-founders to start this project? Okay. Um, il demande quand on a commencé le projet, qu'est-ce qui nous a amené à mettre sur pied ce projet de l'IEP mal? Quelles sont les difficultés auxquelles euh, on a été face? Quel est le besoin que l'IEP mal résout? Qu'est-ce qu qui nous a amené à mettre sur pied ce projet? Alors, tu, tu peux répondre directement yes. à tout ce que tu as à la base du projet Exactement. pour ne pas perdre beaucoup de temps. Parce Exactement. que parler en français et traduire, ça sera très compliqué. Merci, CEO. So, basically, the project, uh, l'IEP mal, uh, as you can see, the platform is lieplimal.net. This, the website of uh, the project and um, the the main concept behind it was because uh, Mr. Emil Pafesim have a very hard strong story as a African uh, local community native he didn't grow inside opulence and uh, uh, it was very difficult for him he had um, this uh, um, uh, education uh, which were not very easy um, uh, he succeeded to become an uh, uh, informatician, a computer engineer, and he decided to have a specialization in software and uh, and uh, maintenance. So uh, according to his research, he started making a little bit money on the internet with few other companies. And um, when he got to Dubai, with uh, he met a great guy called Kami Tabash. Uh, he had a very good training program around about uh, uh, trading and Forex, foreign exchange. And when he was coming back of that uh, training program in Dubai, he heard about cryptocurrency. He advised him to invest a little bit. He, so he invested a very ridiculous amount of 200,000 francs CFA that makes around $300 USD uh, in four cryptocurrencies. I think it's Verge, uh, XRP, Monero, and um, Dogecoin. Dogecoin. So uh, I think less than six months after, the, this four currencies explode. It was that time of when the cryptocurrency get a movement on the market. It was a huge movement, like you can see. Uh, those time, Bitcoin used to quit from 100, 1,005 up to 3,000 in less than two weeks. That was a very crazy movement time and not such like uh, this uh, last two years. And uh, he had a very good explosion and he saw his account get a multiplication value from 200 francs 200,000 francs CFA to 29 million francs CFA that's around um 40 uh, ça peut à peu près combien de dollars faire la conversion 52 dollars for 52,000 dollars around so he saw his account living from that ridiculous very ridiculous amount to 52,000 dollars in less than 6 months and he decided to got out of Africa and have to look for a better life elsewhere. But like one or two months before concretize his life project to get out of Africa and uh, get in other countries to live better, uh, he had a type of revelation. He said to himself, if I made it, I think I can talk about this opportunity to more people for them to make it at the same way like me. The, this is a very great opportunity and people can make money from it. So why not just sharing the information, getting a very good training program on cryptocurrencies and duplicate what I know about it and duplicate the way of having money in this ecosystem. He met the first academy of cryptocurrency uh, here in Cameroon, which is uh, named uh, Academy de la Recite for say, GIT Trading Academy. And uh, from GIT Trading Academy, he had a very few first staff he started with, and people were just coming and buying and selling cryptocurrencies to his personal office. So that was just the first activity. It was the main activity, buying and selling cryptocurrencies. But we faced many issues because there is a there is an education problem issue uh, with the cryptocurrency. When you don't really understand what it is it about, you you can make very big mistakes. So people were coming and buy, uh, like let's say you come and buy for one thousand dollar 
of Bitcoin or USDT or, or maybe XRP. And before reaching home, the value on the market drops. And when the value of the market drop, you, you, you remain like with $800. So you, you don't understand anything about this market. You know that you have buy an active for around $1,000 and now you have uh, 800 in your wallet. It doesn't make sense. So he goes, he complained, the customer goes and complains to the police, all those stuff. So we have uh, to go and explain to the police what is about cryptocurrency. You can imagine how difficult it is in Africa to explain to police who doesn't even imagine that you can have money in your phone in on, on the platform on internet. It was screaming like it was big scams. I mean, like, you, what are you selling in the phone that you're talking about is money? In this time, uh, two or three years ago, it was very hard. It was very difficult to understand what was cryptocurrency. So you he, from police house to police houses, finally he decided to create a concept, a stabilization concept, where you can join in, you buy a crypto package, he trades for you, and he share with you the rentabilities yearly. And when the time comes to give a name to this product, it was very hard for him because he was, he was thinking, what concept name could really pose the, 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 the main vision that he had about this? Because his life was not easier, he knew that you was billionaire, so he decided to name the concept Lie Primal because Lie Primal in his local language or local tongue, is it means poverty is over. So it is the ending of poverty. Mm. Lie is poverty. Liman is over. It's like poverty is over, That's like acronym. Yeah, just like that. It's, it is a local language uh, 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 signification of the concept. So the concept was made for people to just join the cryptocurrency opportunities by buying a crypto package and put at the disposal. He trades, the company trades. Uh, it was not that bigger than it is today. Today we are a big group. It was just a small office of a small company. The product have a big success. We have a success around the world. Now we are present in around the... 150 countries around the world with a whole community of 300 members and uh, you can see from the from the from the token transaction we listed it's around 70 days from now and we are recording like uh 704,000 uh transactions on bscam you can check up and see live what i'm talking about so just in seven days in 70 days so this is a big worldwide record. I think it's uh, not. It is not every day that we see such a, a, a performance on the market. This means we have a very great community that trusts us. We have a very uh, big market that's ready to take handle on uh, on it. We have uh, uh, the Africa market, and now we are transforming the concept. The concept is not more only for uh, Cameroonians or only for people who doesn't understand what cryptocurrency about and invest in those packages. But now it is to go further. We are transcending the project to crypto adoption in all around Africa. We have the, the we, we made this last two years, uh, I think the round of Africa, we made, uh, I think the whole of the countries of the continent uh, to make conferences, seminars. We went to Dubai, all those uh, blockchain and conference seminars, Singapore also. Uh, to establish, first of all, a type of um, interior middle lobbying, like uh, meeting our colleagues from other uh, uh, continents, uh, token creators, ecosystem uh, 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 sharks. And uh, we saw that we had the potential from what we saw and concretely, the token have the potential to become the first cryptocurrency that may be for a crypto adoption in Africa, we can use for vulgarize, for, for vulgarize the cryptocurrency ecosystem. And share of money. And uh, if no one, if no one do anything, uh, there will be a big problem. We will be still late. You know, they used to, uh, to say Africa have a hundred years of late uh, uh, with technology, it is when it is already passed by in other countries that we start using it here. But this time, I think with the digitalization of the continent, with the potentialities of uh, the market that we have here, with the second biggest market of cryptocurrency that is here in Africa, I'm talking not only about in, uh, about Nigeria, which is our nearest uh, uh, country site. Uh, we think we have the really good potential, and you can see from our performance, 
from the 700,000 uh, transactions that we did only on 70 days of listing. This is the project and we are just beginning. All right. Thank you very much for that information, for that uh, of the complete background, how this happened. Uh, to our viewers, if you want to know more about the project, please visit the website you see below, layeplimal.net. There you're going to find more information about the team, about the project, and what is happening. Also, if uh, you want to get closer to the project, please see below their Telegram handle, which you can obviously connect and uh and get in touch with the project their handle is limo coin swap official and in case you want to write to the project please you can do so by email at info at limocoin.net i will leave here on the banner uh for the website so you can take note and uh, we can continue up with this very interesting uh, interview. Can you please explain us now a little bit about the project itself, LimoCoin? Can you tell us uh, more about the business plan and the benefits for, for investors? Okay, great. So basically, as we are saying, we are transcending the project to become uh, the crypto adoption token in Africa. So this means we have many ways of doing it. The first thing is we have a whole community of merchants merchants that accept limo coin as payment way local merchants and international merchants the first uh thing you have to understand we have around 1200 merchants worldwide who accept mm -hmm. limo coin as payment way whether it is to for water bill uh, uh renting payment or i don't know whatever service whatever service it is you can find at least 50 merchants in each of these se activity sectors that we have in Africa. This means what we are building is a, a kind of um, globalization of trades without limit. We are trying to show how it's possible with another business model, economic business model of transaction, and it is really possible in Africa. So with this basic community of merchants of 1,200, we think the, the token have a certain uh, fluidity on the market and you can observe from the number of transactions uh, daily and secondly, um, the community behind. I think um, we have a three hundred thousand members, but it is never enough. Never enough because this represents for ninety five percent uh, of uh, African uh, community. So uh, we are looking for more because this is. I mean, the globalization of the world today is undiscutable. So from what you cannot make a global project that would involve more than one person in. In, in in direct um, um i mean link with cryptocurrency that you don't involve more than just a continent in so secondly what we were looking for uh, is uh, international partnership for uh merchant partnerships like uh, huge hotel groups that we can make partnership with them for them to allow their customer to pay in limo coin swap you know for a hotel or for a restaurant the most important it is the more they have customer, the better it is for them. They make more money. So um, with our community, we can easily on our website show, like you can see in the white paper, there is a list of merchants. You can see from the white paper, there is a list of merchants that you can directly contact and pay in LimoCoin, whatever country you are, if you found a service around you that you want to purchase. So this means that we have a community that we can recommend to your restaurant. As long as they have crypto, it is easier to spend. I mean, it will be difficult, more difficult for you to pay for a caviar if you have to pay in cash than when you have to pay in crypto. I mean, you don't feel the worth of it on, on you. It's easier to spend when you pay directly uh, with crypto. So we can easily recommend. That's what we do. It include It is included in the partnership package. It means that once we make a partnership with a hotel, a restaurant, or whatever else service to accept Limbo coin as payment gateway or payment method, we make a minimum of marketing for you to expose your uh, shop or your institution to all our customers so they know that they can be a direct customer to you. So for you, it is more customers. And we, after, what we can do is uh, you can start accepting the crypto at the rate of the day. So daily you can make conversions. So you don't waste time to wait for the end of the month to have money or like it is with usual uh, electronic payment way. I'm, I'm talking about cards. I'm talking about 
or the mo mobile money systems at, at times for card you have to make a, um, a, a request a withdrawal request it takes some time for you to receive the money you understand what i mean so with crypto it's absolutely instantly and absolutely absu uh, as soon as you have the money you can directly convert on the public market you can swap it on pancake swap you can uh, you can swap it directly on latoken i think it's one of the biggest market of limo coin right now is latoken i think right yeah so that's no, that's perfect yeah so second that's the second thing so for the globalization of the token we are we are looking for these bigger partnerships and this is why we are making a limo coin world tour right now as i'm talking uh um two weeks ago i went in ghana to deliver a training program with the head of trading department. He's still there in Osampansu. He's still there right now as we are talking in Ghana to finish the, the training program because I was just giving the blockchain part and he will be uh, giving the rest part of the trading uh, program for one month to Ghanaian uh, young uh, entrepreneurs and um, investors. So we are doing the same job. We did the same last year in uh, Central Africa Republic uh, with a uh, hundred of young people that have been given by the presidency of the of the of the country we did that and uh, after that i think we received uh, those medals of recognition as uh, knights of the nation and uh, 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 other other recognition uh, medals and uh, we are trying what we are trying to do is to put education first partnership secondly and globalization thirdly the equation is not easy. I think it's very difficult because it is our first time ever experience to try to globalize a token for a continent community. And uh, uh, maybe we will make mistakes during the, the, the way, but I think it is, it is gone for the best. I think it's gone. Yeah, I think it's, it's part of the learning experience, especially if you, if you want to go global there might be some bumps in the road, so to say. Now, you did touch a little bit, you spoke about the token. Can you get more into details about the token, how it gets involved in the project, and what are the benefits for investors to acquire the coin? Okay. From point A to point Z, the token is involved in the project. I mean, this is not a project where we are just raising money to realize another project. No, it is the tokenization of the concept itself. I mean, it is the token to be uh, the main interest or the main purpose of the project. We are not just submitting a token to raise money to realize another project. No, this is not. Uh, you, I think uh, on the fundamental analysis of a, crypt, of the, of a cryptocurrency, the use of the currency or, or of the token is very important. When you make a fundamental analysis, I think traders are understanding what I'm talking about. Um, how useful would be the token for community is very important. So this is a project which is uh, where the token is in the hearts of the functionment of the project. I mean, globalization and vulgarization of cryptocurrency markets in Africa is all about using limo coin to do it nothing else okay you understand so that's first secondly uh we have these amazing staking packages that you can easily purchase uh we have uh, two type of uh, staking packages uh we have uh, the direct staking packages that people can purchase directly from the exchange i think it is up to 20 percent and uh, we have the second one which is um, on liaplimal.net platform directly uh which is up to 37 percent but it is in two years i mean the staking is uh you uh, earn um from the payout you receive the benefits only the profits yearly and after one year the half of the capital is unlocked to you and you receive the rest of the benefits during one more year and at the end of the second year the second part of the capital is unlock also so it is an amazing uh sticking package for long-term investors who doesn't want to uh, uh make uh, um how did they say scarce on the market they just want to invest because they believe in the project and they are seeing what we are doing with proof 
on what we are doing all around the continent. So it's for long-term investors. And um, for short-term investors, I think this is the best time. I'm, I'm a little bit ashamed to say the value of the token has dropped recently, but it is true and that's the reality of the market. If there is not those vibes of going down, going up, there is no market. It is when the, the token can drop and get up and go go upper when, when there is market. So it can bear and, and bull. So um, lastly, we had um, on December, uh, 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 I think it was about Christmas time, and you know what party represents for us. Africa is really important when you invest in a project, when you can have access to money at any time. And uh, it was uh, for December, and people, I think, from the logic, 99% uh, of our community were ex absolutely Africans. So it was not... Uh, as as open as it is right now, so I think um, early early investors were looking for complementary solutions. So we have a a big vibe of sales. People sales a lot to so have money because you you can imagine what can represent end of year party time for us here in Africa, and we don't have a lot of revenue uh, in, uh, uh, of of income sources. So um, I most of the time it's around two or three income sources for most of the people and at times even just one so people sell a lot uh, for that and we had this drop time and um yeah we we accept it it's a it's a it's a part of the market it's a part of the game it can happen but the most important is what strategy we are putting behind for it to getting up as soon as possible and go upper so what we 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 we, we you can easily um see on the market from the drop of the token, I think we are raising up right now. You can absolutely see that we quit from 0 0.028 uh, uh, two weeks ago to 0 0.04 right now. So somebody that invested two weeks ago in our token should have made around the double for now. So I think, the why? Why? Because just because I think we have a potential community, we have a huge market, we have a very big need, we have a continent, a virgin continent where we have green card to start vigorization of the cryptocurrency in Africa. Our token is the pilot project that we are going to use for this globalization. After this, we are going and we are already doing um, proposals to governments, to central banks of how uh, a cryptocurrency can be helpful like other central banks around the world are doing right now. We are trying not to copy paste a model, but adapting to our financial and monetary realities that we have here, because it's really different. You can, you can, you can, believe me, it's really different from monetary system of elsewhere around the world. We have our own reality. So these proposals, and we are also making our best, we are fighting for uh, a regulation of our ecosystem in Africa. We were the first to handle and uh, take hand of uh, the regulation, the regulation agency, I think it's the Kokuzimaf, is the, the monetary regulation uh, um, agency for um, the all the Central Africa region. We have around, uh, we have many countries that are involved in this, uh, of this uh, monetary zone. So we were the first to go to them and tell them please try to regulate our ecosystem because where there is honey, there is also bees. So I think it's not going to be for, for, for soon that we are going to face many issues, but as soon as we regulate, we, we regulate it, we are going to um, be sure that we, we do the best for the people not to be scammed a lot by people who will come and try to say, excuse me, the term bullshit to uh, uh, very accessible customers that are only asking to become like Mr. M. Parfessim and make a lot of money on the crypto market. You can understand. Yeah, so, I think that's really good news that uh, that you are trying to be regulated. You're pushing yeah. for it. Yeah. And again, for our viewers, education is the most important thing. So you have to be educated about the project. You okay. have to learn more about it. And once again, I'm going to put here the website. You can see below, lieplimal.net. Please visit the website, read the white paper, get educated about this project, know the details about it, and uh, and get to know the benefits. Uh, we have here uh, two of the main uh, representatives, the founder, and I think that's a, that's a very good thing that you are actually giving your face. You, you're showing yourself. I think that's part of the 
transparency is required. We have over seven, 600 live viewers right now. A lot of them are posting their comments. I can see a lot of hearts. So yeah, it seems you have a very big and strong community. Thank you. Which is always good. So well done for that. And now, uh, obviously, there are other projects, as you mentioned, out there in the market. Some of them might be trying to do something that you're doing, maybe in your a geographic region in Africa or maybe somewhere else. But can you explain to us what makes your project different from others so that the investors can move forward and invest in your project? Okay. Okay. So, I think the quelle est la différence and the particularity that peut rendre notre projet different des autres projects? Okay. Firstly, you have to understand we are in a virgin market. Mm -hmm. We are in a virgin market. This means opportunity, opportunities, and opportunities. And uh, for a such project where the token is involved in the heart of the project and the value of the token is involved in the heart of the project, when you are in a vision market that you are conquering, early investors will always be the more the most gainers. So I mean, uh, maybe for short term or for daily trades, it can't be or it can be I don't know interesting for traders, but for long terms or let me say long term is very relative, like six, four, three, one year or two years. It's very, very important what can happen on this token because what we are doing, we are working with governments, not only ours, but from other countries where we have our lobbying. Uh, we are working for crypto adoption. We are working with a whole group of experts worldwide. You can try to read about the project and you can understand how powerful we try to, uh, um, how did they say it? Even in French, I don't found the word. I mean, to bring together the energies um, to concretize this dream of crypto adoption is in Africa. The first particularity is education. We are trying, what we are trying to do is to open mind people that they can understand that there is this crazy opportunity of having more efficiency transaction with crypto and uh, earning more with this investment sector, but not only trying to show how another business model is possible to impact on, on, on the economy of the, on the continent. I think in the next 20 years, cryptocurrency will be at least for 20% of the rentability of the, or maybe the increase of uh, the benefits that activities can bring out in Africa. I think if we focus enough, in, if we look around the opportunities that this crypto industry industry is bringing us here in Africa as facilities, we can easily understand that we are going to be bigger and bigger. And as pioneer of this type of project on this virgin market, and our token as the pilot project in the heart as pilot project of this market, I think you can only have benefits from the value of the token when it will increase in less than two years very 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 soon when i'm talking about very very soon i mean it's like in maybe in six months for you maybe it will be in three months the value will be okay for you you can out of the market maybe it is in two years that depends on you but we are here to stay and for long with very aggressive strategies and uh it wouldn't be easier uh uh, uh we will face many um opposants we will be facing many difficulties but we are sure that every incrementing innovation that is inside and very uh, virgin markets have a very great potential to make his of his early investors the happier of the her of the earth I, I i really do think yes I want, yeah. to add some, yes I want to add something for you to keep not a project déjà fait partie d'un group une entreprise de 23 qui contient des entreprises et particulièrement dans l'immobilier où nous sommes avec des investissements que nous avons fait de gauche à droite pour pouvoir à, solidifier notre token derrière. Mm -hmm. On n'a pas créé un token pour lever les fonds, mais on a créé un token pour être utilisé mm -hmm. dans la société. Ok. 
So uh, as I didn't mention before from our realization, you have to understand we are now a, a group of companies. The group own 23 companies, 23 prosperous companies around the continent. Yeah, so, so from the project, from the initiative, so from the initiative, you can easily find out our realization. You have, we have this amazing city that we built in Ghana of 250 luxury villas. I think uh, we are selling it right now. It is $400,000 for one, each villas. We have this crazy city. We have um, many buildings we are making. Yeah, we have here in Cameroon. Uh, we have in Cameroon, we have two hotels in Kribi that we are building now. In Yaoundé, the political capital of the country, we have another city of 50 luxury villas, standard one, uh, that costs around $150,000, so they are standard. And uh, we have um, uh, another uh, hotel project in Senegal we are building. Um, I think from the other side of the project, what we did, it was not only counting on the merchants, on the 100 and 200, 1,200 merchants that we have now. We try to build our own projects around this to show them how easier it can be useful. So, like, let's say you are buying a limo coin now for 0 0.04 or not. Let's say you bought in two weeks ago uh, on 0 0.02 one limo coin and you 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 bought it because you wanted to buy a house you wanted to purchase a house uh that we own maybe in accra or maybe here in cameroon and let's say now in two weeks you have the value increased times two i think you will have now the capital to buy two houses instead of only one i think we are trying to show them or sh show the continent the institutions the people the ecosystem, the economic ecosystem, entire economic ecosystem all around us. How useful this cryptocurrency ecosystem model as our token can be adopted, as the pilot project can be useful and can increase, or how did they say it? On the creation de richesse en français, I mean, value creation, how it can create value uh, mm -hmm. around uh, uh, investment of our investors. They can be earlier investor, they can be future investor, but we make sure that as long as the project is going, it goes bigger and bigger and bigger. So no matter what time you join the project as investors, or as long-term investors, as short-term investor, you will make benefit from it and be happy. So now, um, yeah. now that you're talking about the future, one question I like to ask is, oh. Uh, what about the roadmap of LimaCoin? I know in with the crypto world, it's very difficult to forecast what's going to happen in one year, right? Because of the uh, changes, the regulation, the market, and so on. But uh, where do you think LimaCoin is going mm -hmm. to be in the next three years? Oh, to this answer, uh, I think easily it would be better sure it's as you say it's very difficult to forecast in one year or two years or three years exactly what would happen i mean anything can happen alike in any other investment but um for sure from our projection it will be adopted by at least three or four services of governments maybe it is not from our country maybe it will be in our country maybe it will be in other countries but from the discussion we have with various governments i think many services are going to be allowed to be paid in limo coin uh, that would be one thing that could be uh, that will certainly happen secondly as um, crypto adoption model i think we will be more we will having more merchants i think at least if you have now 1200 merchants accepting limo coin swap as payment way i think will be at least at 12000 in 3 years because we are not stopping our strategies we are only starting you can understand mm -hmm. as educational model uh, as we are making this world tour and we are giving this education program like we did in central republic Afri central african republic as we did in cameroon as we did or we are doing in Accra, and we are going to do in other countries, we are building up a community uh, of people that will, uh, will be like to experiment the ecosystem and they will not start with the token that will come from the sky. 
they will start with our token. So what we are building at the same time that we are doing this uh, education evangelism, we are building a community of uh, people that will be with us. And you know, when you have one guy which is happy, surely you have 10 other ones. So what we are doing is a type of evangelism for uh, our community to grow at the same time that we are giving this education program. And it is, I think, really interesting for a trader to, to be sure that uh, uh, a token he is buying today is going to have a community which will only grow and grow and again and again and again and never stop. Uh, from a, a, a very, very long time. Et, et, et puis, nous avons notre blockchain LMC20 que nous allons commencer la transition dès le mois de, de, de mars, avril pour solidifier notre token pour pouvoir digitaliser les systèmes euh, institutionnels en Afrique, le cas d'Anté, les arts de licence et tout ça, qui sera, n'est-ce pas, viendra solidifier notre token. Faut aussi expliquer okay. ça. So, from this... C'est même euh... sur notre white paper. Okay, so you can see in, in our white paper, one of the, 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 the main things we are going to do, uh, I, I think it is from the last points, uh, institutionally, also from uh, March to April, we will start uh, building our own proper blockchain, uh, which will be the, the LMC, LMC 20, uh, 20 uh, that we are going to launch. Uh, this blockchain have the aim to digitalize institutional uh, uh, services, uh, ID cards, birth card, birthday certificates, all the other uh, uh, services around the continent uh, um, to complete and to offer a complete service offer. Like if we, as we are in discussion with many governments in Africa, we would like to offer them complete packages, not only about cryptocurrency, regularity, Vulgar regularization. Yeah, sorry, because I'm French native. So, yeah. Yeah, so as it is not only about token evangelism, it's not only about cryptocurrency evangelism, it is also about showing concrete solutions. So we are building this uh, private blockchain to concretize those projects that can be possible around the continent. And remember, we are on a virgin market and our token will be totally swapped on the new... Uh, uh, blockchain platform and I hope we could make great partnership with platforms like LA token so that if more tokens decide to use our blockchain our private blockchain for to to for exploration uh, it could be accepted on listing system so yeah so basically it is that is another level of the project and we are only starting it at the end of March uh, starting of April April for blockchain building itself uh, and after that we will present publicly in more details, the characteristic and the advantages of our proper blockchain in that time. So for now, we can only say that, but I think once it will be done, the token also will be swapped there. And um, also the value of the token will absolutely depend uh, uh, not only from the community we are building around the continent, not only from the merchant and the transactions we are they having, not only from the traders and the community is growing, not only uh, from the from the reputation of the token, but also from this technical project that will be uh, 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 directly uh, uh, linked to the blockchain. Uh, we are going to give complete solutions for institutions, governments multinational companies also. Et, et, et oui, le sera le proof of staking, ça fait que ceux qui achètent le token aujourd'hui seront, n'est-ce pas, les validateurs de cette blockchain-là. Ok. Ce pas le proof of work, ni le premier le proof of staking. Ok, so, uh, the validate, what we can say from the blockchain now is that the system will be a proof of stake. So, it will be a proof of stake system. So, the early investors, people that are buying the token now, uh, we shall be uh, the first to who we might propose uh, 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 to be the validators of uh, the, 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 the system. So I think any investors that uh, we join us now on the epimark.net platform, I think they are going to be the one which will receive first the opportunities by push maze, by pop up on the platform. They'll receive first the opportunities that we have inside the company so they can handle, they can take on it and make more money than expected, not only on public markets. Okay, thank you for that information. Um, mm -hmm. We're getting close to the end of the show. And uh, gentlemen, when you have ready uh, your new developments, you're welcome on the show again. We can have a different show. I expect probably by the end of March. Uh, I see you have a very strong community. So we will invite your community. 
and then we can uh, we can once again like uh, touch all the topics, all the questions that your the community may have. Uh, and that said, uh, in order to close this this uh, interview, do you have any final remarks? Any last words for your for your communities for the viewers? I will leave the spot for our CEO, please. CEO, un dernier mot pour la communauté, une remarque, un conseil pour eux. Euh, je dirais simplement que le monde de la crypto-monnaie, c'est un monde nouveau. C'est un monde encore nouveau en Afrique francophone. Et puis, c'est toute une procédure. Ce sont des étapes à suivre. Un investissement, ce n'est pas sur du court terme, généralement. Vous voyez, en Afrique, nous avons l'habitude d'investir. Euh, par exemple, lorsqu'on rentre dans l'agriculture, c'est pour faire les champs de cacao, c'est pour faire les palmeraies à huile. Mais vous convenez avec moi que pour faire un champ de cacao, il faut attendre au moins trois ans, quatre ans, cinq ans, mais pour les plantes améliorées. Quand vous faites euh, l'investissement dans les, les palmeraies à huile, c'est pour attendre trois ans, quatre ans. C'est la même chose avec la crypto-monnaie. Avant, nous étions dans un système euh, un peu introductif dans ce secteur. Maintenant, nous sommes rentrés directement dans la crypto-monnaie et c'est maintenant que le business commence. Je ne vais cesser de vous le dire, mais sachez que c'est maintenant que le business commence. Notre crypto-monnaie a été euh, créée pour du très long terme. Nous n'avons pas créé une crypto-monnaie comme toutes les autres personnes qui ont la crypto-monnaie. Notre crypto-monnaie, c'est la seule qui a été, ça dit, c'est l'une des seules crypto-monnaies qui a été créée déjà avec une base solide, avec des entreprises existantes, avec, n'est-ce pas, une communauté existante. Généralement, les crypto-monnaies qui sont créées, n'est-ce pas, sont faites pour lever des fonds avant de créer d'autres entreprises. Mais nous, ça a été le contraire et c'est ça qui fait notre particularité. Alors, je vous conseille d'acheter vos crypto-monnaies aujourd'hui dans la plateforme, la token, vous êtes là, vous nous voyez très bien, euh, c'est pour assurer votre avenir, c'est pour assurer l'avenir de vos enfants, c'est pour assurer l'avenir de vos petits-enfants. Parce que le système n'est pas fait pour finir aujourd'hui ou demain, mais le système est là pour un terme très très long. Donc, euh, je vais lui dire simplement merci, parce que euh, cette interview va nous permettre de nous mettre encore au boulot, parce que des promesses et des, 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 des informations qu'on donne ici, on doit absolument les tenir. L'IMOCOIN fait partie d'un groupe d'entreprises qui compte 23 entreprises, une compagnie aérienne, une chaîne de télévision, une microfinance, une société civile immobilière et une société euh, de bâtiments et travaux publics. 23 entreprises. Je vous assure, très peu de crypto-monnaies ont été créées dans cette condition. Donc, le LIMOCOIN, c'est votre avenir, c'est l'avenir de l'Afrique, c'est l'avenir de la jeunesse africaine. Investir aujourd'hui dans la crypto-monnaie, c'est en partie, contribuer au développement et à l'avenir de l'Afrique. Can you translate, please? Yes, thank you, CEO. So, I uh, will resume uh, what our <coughs> CEO says. So, um, as Africans, uh, you have to understand, most of the time when we make an investment, it is most of the time for long term. And uh, uh, LimoCoin have been talked in that way. So, we the project to be a long-term a very long-term project when you invest in uh, a plantation i mean you can invest in palms you can invest in agriculture in africa because in africa it is what we do most of the time in agriculture so when we do those uh, uh, investment it is most of the time for not less than one to two years we we don't work like americans americans work for corn corn is three months two months it is mm -hmm. done it works for uh, uh uh, uh, other type of uh, three months uh, cultures, but we have this culture of long term for precious things that takes uh, more value to grow and in what we can put more passion and more 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 strong in hard work. So our token is a long term benefit token. We you can start making benefit from it from now uh, if you are. Uh, are already aware of what the market is and uh, you can easily have uh, anything from it but it is a long-term project that we are doing to prove or to show how possible another paradigm is possible 
So we are doing this project uh, to show and the way to our brothers and sisters to where we are going, what we are going to do and what we can do together to make Africa great again. So in resume, what that's what our uh, CEO says. He thanks you also, uh, my dear manager. Thank you uh, very much. He advised uh, people uh, to buy massively on Latoken. This is one of our biggest market platform in exchange. We really appreciate collaboration with you since the start. And uh, we hope, yes, to be with you at the end of March for project updates so we can, from transparency, tell you at what point we are with the project and make the same uh, at least, I mean, uh, each three or four, four, four months. Like that. So oh, thank um, you very much. Thank you, community. Thank you, guys. Uh, thank you, traders. And thank you very much, Lato Ken. Thank you. To our, uh, well, it has been a great uh, and very interesting uh, learning experience to know about uh, Limo coin. Very interesting, very detailed. I appreciate your, your help with the translation as well, Jeff. Uh, I you see that you have a very strong community. And again, it, it, every project, it, it's about learning what is it about. That's why we're here. That's what we do. And to our viewers, once again, please visit the website, theeplimal.net. Educate yourself about the project. And with that said, well, again, I would very much like to thank uh, Mr. Amit Prefat. And Jeff, thank you for assistance and translation. To our dear viewers, thank you for engagement. We did get all your messages and we expect to have another show, hopefully by the end of March. Yeah. Until then, once again, uh, I do wish you the best to our viewers. Stay safe, take care, and it'll be until next time. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you.